ask us sundram from bachu so if you're a facilities management company wondering hey what are the steps that i can take to mitigate the risks that are on brexit there are three areas which i suggest that you might need to look carefully number one is the labor and skills shortages hiring is likely to be impacted as the uk fm industry employs european union workers across multiple skill sets the devaluation of pound sterling cost of brexit would expectedly reduce the value of the wage and influence the employers to migrate so do focus on where your labor is coming from and how you can mitigate the risk number 2 wage hike and contract terms in the aftermath of brexit businesses are likely to struggle in filling potential areas in contract delivery and up shelling more for the right talent in certain areas since personal costs are usually the largest cost in assessing fm contract delivery higher wages could have long standing effects in your contracts so if you have a punitive performance regime please have a look at how you can mitigate those risks from your buyer number 3 supply chain one of the key reasons for the fm sector to consider or to evaluate where they are with brexit is the supply chain disruption caused by brexit to the supply of goods such as chemicals consumables food products and electrical and mechanical components will have a lasting impact in your organization brexit in any form is likely to disrupt fm market fm providers should look at this as an opportunity to get ahead of the competition by actively envisaging and quashing challenges above other three that are listed brought forward by brexit it could be something else for you but we believe that these three number 1 labor and skill shortage number 2 wage hike and contract terms impact number 3 the supply chain might have much more impact in your business than most other things if you want to know more about how you can mitigate against brexit you can visit www.bachu.com/brexit and subscribe to our newsletter where we'll be able to give you the brexit developments on a weekly basis so you can start to work together in mitigating the brexit aftermath good luck